Candice is trying to take over and featuring Mohal, the lady. We're calling her the queen. So you can she's she's gonna take my place and be in the middle. See, I told you she's taking over my channel. <laughs> you guys. Wait, why do you have four books? Because they're actually my giveaway ones that I'm <gasps> giving to my lucky winners this week. Yeah, from my channel or from your page? From my page. <laughs> Uh, so I also have to see. Not I'm the bad friend. <laughs> now I also have to now buy books and do. You fine, can. I'll give away two. There we go. She's giving away two books. Yay. Oh, okay, guys. So this is what we're doing. We are going to be making a Christmas lunch. You guys know I'm hosting. Mm -hmm. I'm still deciding whether I'm cooking or not. But if I am cooking, this is definitely what I am going to be making. Are you cooking or getting a chef? I'm um, so I'm getting, We are leaving on the 26th on holidays, so on the 25th we are getting a chef to come and cook for us. Okay, so you are cook. You are getting a chef. You I'm getting a chef, but I'm doing Christmas Eve. Okay. Oh, but are you all cooking? cooking? On Christmas Eve. Yes. Oh, oh, not, so a, not cooking. Christmas lunch. Oh, okay, so. great. Um, so we are gonna. Well, I was gonna tell us what we're making. Mm -hmm. We're not gonna show all the details because ultimately you have to get it in the recipe book, which means you guys have to go buy it. Yes. Right. Yeah. Oh, right. You want to awesome. take that? Are some of these on the in the taste magazine as well? Yes. They yeah. Are. We got the taste magazine. I've got the taste. Hold on. Can we get it? How does it feel? From accountant to to cooking to lazy makoti to magazine contributor. Yeah. Um. I think I haven't quite had time to digest everything that's happened like in this year. Yeah, it's a lot. Um, yeah, so I'm really looking forward to the break and just like taking it all in. Yeah. You made a lot of food, girl. Right. She right. made a lot of food. Okay, cool. Talk us through what we're making today. So first, we are going to start with the star of Christmas. Okay. As per your as request. As by me. Yes. We that. are doing some gammon. Yes. Yes. For those who are not gammon, is kikulube. <laughs> Okay, continue. So first we're gonna start with the gammon and then I'm gonna show you how to make um, a glaze from scratch. Yay. Which, <laughs> not quite. <laughs> I could say that. <laughs> not quite a baby. Okay, it's not gravy. Yeah, yeah, but I'm hoping one of you will make it. I don't mind. I, I make want, the glaze. I want whatever would make my hands smell like onion. Uh, I don't want she got special requests now. Yeah, okay. Okay, okay, continue. Let's see how this goes. And then once we're done with the star, the gammon, um, we are going to make, what did I say was Cookies? Next? Cookies. Yes, the cookies. So I got this kit, um, but you can do this yourself. You don't need the kit. Okay. But today we're going to use the yeah. kit. And Get then, the kit. Yeah. Get the kit. Actually, get the kit. It's so easy. Yeah, yeah. Especially if you're making everything else from scratch. Yeah. Exactly. Get the kit. Yeah. Exactly. And this is fun because you can get the kits to decorate their own. Yeah. This looks so so pretty they'll and that. cute. They'll be a mess, but they'll love it. Yeah. Yeah. You clean up after. And then we're gonna make a salmon summer salad with like lots of color and lots of flowers. It's gonna be really How really cute pretty. These flowers. Do you actually eat these yes. flowers? Yes, they are edible. Do you enjoy them, or are you to say they're edible because they look pretty? I know they're edible, but do you just put them because they're pretty or do you like the taste? Okay, honestly, first for me, it's is that they look pretty. Okay. Yeah. And then do you eat them or do you move them to the side of your I, I eat them with the dressing all over, okay. I eat them. Okay. Yeah. Candice, do you eat your flowers? No, but I'll try them today. <laughs> <laughs> I also move them on the side. Okay, should we get started? And then, sorry, oh, okay. last yeah, yeah. but not least is our cocktail. You can either make one with um, some bubbles, some champagne, mm -hmm. or a virgin one. Mm -hmm. It'll still taste amazing. Excited. I think I'm going to make um, a bubbles for my grandparents. Yay! So, we'll see how they taste. We'll see it. how it goes. <laughs> no. I've got it in All right. Good luck. Okay, who's making what? You tell us. You okay. both are out. We all sort of working together, yeah. kind of. Yeah. Um, so let's start with the gammon. Okay. So I just got this whole one so everyone can see what it actually looks like mm -hmm. what you'll be looking for in store mm -hmm. and then we have one that's already like Four on minutes, the yeah. stove it cooking takes about what two hours so i'd say three about three hours you yeah. really want it to cook yeah um and then now we're just going to make the glaze all right let's get started so guys if, are, if you are making gammon for christmas please start cooking it early like we said yeah. it takes about three hours well mm -hmm. you can um, get a cook one apparently but they're oh, pretty much sold out so you really? can you can get a cooked gammon with no glaze, which you'll still make your own glaze, the same glaze that Lisa Cosby's making. But we couldn't actually find one because she's told everyone about them and now they've <laughs> all sold out. Just so you might have to cook one this year. Okay, let's scratch. start with the glaze. Yes. 
So these are your ingredients for the glaze. Um, you need a little bit of butter, berries, some berries, and some sugar, which you're not using the honey. And then this goes in a pot with a little bit of water, and, and then just cook that easy. down. That's it. That's the it. It's, that's how easy it is. Okay, let's do this. So for the for the gammon, we have it boiling in there, salt and pepper, and just some chopped onion. Okay, that's and that's it. it. Yeah. Are we still gonna put the gammon in the oven? It's still gonna go in the oven with the glaze, but like for ten minutes. Uh, for like ten minutes. Okay, for like cool. Ten minutes. So do we have to chop these? Or no, they're no. gonna melt in. So they go in. They're actually called flavor bursts. Okay. And as they cook, so they're gonna like. Oh, burst. Burst with like yeah. normal blueberries and then flavor burst and if you get the normal ones it's just not the same so how really it yeah. says flavor burst on the front it's a little bit more I expensive know. but totally worth it <laughs> who wants to do this i'll do it this is simple okay, enough perfect so everything literally goes in the in the pot or pan okay. um, same time or do i melt the butter first same time okay let me someone do it here and then i'll put it on the pot That's perfect i'm gonna get some i'm gonna do it here okay go for it okay so how much butter one tablespoon this is fancy I love gold cutlery. Just one tablespoon. Guys, cutlery, I don't know how you guys do this cooking thing, especially you. Gold cutlery is like a thousand rand for like three little things. I, if it looks pretty. Oh, There's the old fashioned ones, know. but it doesn't last I, very well. Can I do this? Just use your finger, no? Right? <laughs> <laughs> you see why I can't have gold cutlery? I was about to take the gold out. Okay, and then? And then um, your flavor burst. Berries can go in there. Yes. Okay. They rinsed already, guys. They and we did sanitize. We did. Candice made us sanitize. I made, I'm like on a mission, guys. What's that? I'm water. This was just water, water. And then in goes your sugar. Alrighty. And, and we're done. Stove. On the stove we go. Yeah. So now our um, oven is on, waiting for our glaze to be done and then for us to glaze our. Gavin. Oh, Gavin. She's and tired, guys. She's, she's been doing, doing this the whole year. Time. We get it. It's okay. I, I actually saw, I just want to put it out there, for yeah. those people that don't have a lot of time, mm -hmm. I did see a blueberry glaze in a little jar at Woolies yeah, that yeah. I made for. I actually and I thought, uh -huh. really? I do, because Woolies sent me some food. Um, oh, yes, when you hosted Yeah, when I hosted oh, things. So I actually beautiful. have. Yeah. What is the one food that you look forward to on Christmas? The one thing that you just like, I'm gonna eat a lot of this. Gammon. Gammon, yeah, you? That's just right. like that. Just, I just want gammon. And... Do you like the fat part of it? No, I don't like the fat of anything. Oh, I love the fatty part of it. I love yeah. the fat of everything. Yeah, me too. I have a pro that's a problem. No, I, I, I can't you? eat the fat of anything. Um, so me and my mom are obsessed with dessert tables. So oh, every year on Christmas like make a dessert really? table. We should yeah. have a trifle. No, we Guys, there's a trifle. I have to show you because it's just another level of trifles. I've never the seen The Pavlova one. Where is it? Where is it? You should know this book off a heart right now. Oh, please. Where is it? Two hours later. I saw it last night. You show Are me. Are you making it? That? It is the most next level trifle I've ever seen, guys. That's you know, not as genuine. You don't need a boring trifle anymore. This is impressive. Three days later. I even thought to myself, I'm gonna make this trifle. Oh, you really? Yes, I'm gonna make this trifle. Wait until you see how impressive it is. When we find it. Many months later. Here we go. Here we go. Oh my gosh, this looks fancy. Have you ever? Is that not a trifle or what? Stunning. So you can't make an average trifle anymore, thanks to Woody's. Tell <laughs> so my mom. Thanks to Woody's. Candice, what's Make your friend? You'll never guess. What? Mine is totally a roast potato. Really? Roast potato any day. I save myself. Is there a roast something potato. special you do? Um, yes. Um, you can tell me if I'm wrong or how, but you need to pre cook, pre boil them. Yeah. I like them with the jackets on, and I like waxy on. potatoes. What's mm. waxy potatoes? They like have like a waxy kind of deep it's rich a kind taste. Of, uh, potato. Really? So when yep. you guys go for buy potatoes, you look look yes. like kind. They have the most delicious ones that we use. I actually don't know what the name is now. Have them in my cupboard. I'll go get them. Okay. <laughs> of course. Guys, apparently there's different types of potatoes. I yeah. just grabbed the cheapest bag. Look, it depends. If I want like big ones, then or I'll like get the perfect or little ones. They even That's call it. them 
a bowl buttery Apache, Apache potatoes. Apache potatoes. Okay. They are so good. Oh, I love making salads. Yeah, both. Okay. okay. You go, tell me, are we doing it on here? So you're trying to get like cool. nice shapes. I feel like it's so Oh, is that how you guys get yes. the shape? Yes, oh, I, so I like, always do this. Ah. You curl it. I didn't know that. And if you put this in like very cold water, yeah, they'll actually like curl up and twist up. Like do like a curl. Oh wow. Like icy water. Actually, pop them. Ah. Do we I have icy water? Yes. I will get some icy water. And then you all can right, just. Alright, alright. Yeah. So instead of like the same boring like chopping, <laughs> do it here. Yeah. I'll get some icy water for us. <laughs> and do it on the board so it can give you like balance. Yeah, see, it's, it's so much easier to do. This is hard! <laughs> I... <laughs> see? There we go. Hi, hey, well, guys, look at my carrot! <laughs> Babe, how fancy? Fancy, fancy. So you just need a grater. It's a not peeler. Like a, grater, a peeler, sorry. There's your icy water. There's my icy water. And then icy water is a friend to your veggies, your herbs, every single thing. Just put it in your icy water. Really? Yeah. Makes it look. It makes it fresher as well. Oh. You know, like yeah, like that crunch that you want with your raw veggies. We're learning lots yes, of tips, you get guys. That from your ice your, water. From your ice okay, water. Okay. What else am I doing? And then I'm just gonna show you what I did here earlier. So in here is just the red onion and some red wine vinegar, and I'm basically doing a quick pickle. Okay. Oh, that's such a great way to do a pickle, isn't Yeah, it? like very quick. So if you look at the color, so see now it has like that um, two colors, yeah, yeah sort of an ombre effect. Yeah. So that's how so you get it. Like tie dye. Yeah, actually. So that's how you and get it. How do you know so much about cooking? Do you know what? I have it. I really used to always watch the cooking channel. Really? Like yeah. And then my sister and I used to pretend that we were cooking in the kitchen to like an audience. <laughs> and we'd put like all of our dishes like out with all the ingredients. We'd be like, and now we're going to throw in the salt. Oh my gosh. I don't know. It was like fun. So yeah, that's how you make like a very quick pickle. Literally just chop my onion, um, added some red wine red vinegar. Wine. And then even the color starting to change. And how long do you leave it on? As long as you want. As long as the you longer want. the better, obviously, right? Yeah. Um, and you can get all the ingredients at Woolies, right? Yeah. Yeah. Well. yeah. And, and you're just finally slice this. Yes. Perfect. So who is your celebrity, or not even a celebrity chef? Like, what chef has always have has always inspired you in the past? Um, I think uh, Mama Dora Sitole. Who's like, she's a chef. She is. Ah. So she's been editor for basically every single publication that my mom used to read. And she was food editor for all those publications. Really? So I think she's the first time I, I saw that you can actually um, make food for a living. That's amazing. Because of her. I didn't know that. Yeah, I'm just adding now. And the only chef I know is Jamie Oliver. I love Jamie Oliver. <laughs> <laughs> and Jamie. me. And, 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 and well, obviously. <laughs> I just think what is so amazing about your book, and I think mm -hmm. Pumi will agree, is like they are. I love that there's a local, a localized element of it, and yeah. I think it it like makes you food makes you feel nostalgic yeah. about mm. a time in your life or an experience True. or memory. True. And I don't know, it brings that out. It's like a, it's like smells. Do you ever have that? Where like a certain smell reminds you of something. For me, it's songs, not smells. And songs, oh. songs, definitely songs, not not. No, but smells well, but smells only with my husband's um, cologne. Aww. Yeah, you guys. Yeah, that's basically the only thing. That's so cute. But I'm not, I haven't been experimental with food. I've told you guys this, like, I'm a very, very safe eater. Um, I don't, I, I basically don't eat anywhere strange. But now I've decided to open myself up to different types of food. You're coming uh, to see me in Cape Town and I'm taking you everywhere. Oh my word, guys, I have Town. booked everywhere. When are, when are you going back? Um, sometime in Feb. Oh, we're supposed to go in Jan. We are going to so many restaurants. Okay, I think this is enough. What's next? Our carrots. Let's do our carrots. And then I'm going to have Candace do the cucumber. No worries. Just how Bumi was doing it. With the with the with peeler. Yeah, the I'll fancy do it as soon one. As she's done. And what is your favorite food for me? My favorite food is. What is my favorite food? Really? It has to be curry. 
It has to be curry. Like Indian time is Indian food. I know, because you had biryani at Nuri's Indian, birthday. Yeah, which I we know. all ate. Everybody and we enjoyed loved it. it. Like Indian food for me is honestly it. I also Indian love it. Indian food. I love a korma, I love a tandoori. Mm-hmm. I'll anything you can check on what's your favorite food? Oh, this looks good. Oh my god. I love unhealthy food, which I don't that eat. That smells so nice. I love lamb shank. I mm-hmm. love oxtail. I love I love like a really delicious hearty food. That sounds too. like yeah, warm and hearty, hearty and food. comforting. And what is Christmas looking like for you guys this year? Uh, for me, I'm hosting Christmas for the first time. Um, oh, what are you cooking? I'm dying. Sorry. I was gonna cook, guys. I, I think I'm enough. gonna do what you're doing, um, Candice. Because my family is coming on the 24th and the 25th. Oh. So on the 24th, we're dedicating my son. Oh, uh, yeah, I'm doing it at home. So Nuri got dedicated by Brendan's dad because he's a pastor. That's but incredible. we did it at his church. But this time we're like, oh, we can just do it at home. Absolutely. So Zani's getting dedicated on the 24th. So I'll probably cook mm-hmm. then. And then on the 25th, I have my sweet potato. She did the food. At, she is incredible. She's amazing. So she's doing our Christmas lunch. I think um, that's is that enough? Yeah. Uh, and let's and use this cucumber. What's wrong with this one? Because look at the difference. So you want to see that texture. Oh, oh Candice. You did it wrong. Oh, I'm sorry. No, she didn't. <laughs> 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 I'm, <sorry. laughs> I'm kidding. So you want to oh, get, like get this texture. That beautiful texture. Okay. Should I put it in here as well? Yeah, yeah. you can use the one cool. there. So what are we doing with this? <laughs> you can have it. Yes. Candice, what are you doing? Um, so on the 24th, it's going to be just like my immediate family, like my sister, mm-hmm. her fiance, the twins, Lorenzo, and I'm going to host a little Christmas Eve dinner and I will mm-hmm. definitely cook something lovely. Are you dressing up? I will definitely dress up. There will definitely be a theme. Um, and then on Christmas, we are going to go to Lorenzo's family. And they are they in South Africa? They're here. Oh, okay. and we are going to have a, actually it's quite interesting, mm-hmm. um, we've got a caterer who is actually Greek, she's from Greece. Oh wow. And she's going to be making a whole lot of Greek food for us. Oh, oh nice. Yummy. So that should be really good. Um, and that's what we're going to do. But Christmas for me is just, um, you know, we used to summer Christmas, mm-hmm. um, but I don't know, there's something about being in the snow that just feels even more Christmassy. Wait, so are you going? We not this year, but oh. which I'll miss. But we usually we do usually do spend um, Christmas in the snow. That's nice. Oh. I'd love to do that. It's the kids would just love it. Yeah. You know, Nuri's at an age now where she'd love it, love yeah. the snow. Yeah. yeah. So I, is I, the only reason why you're not doing that this year because of yeah, COVID. Yeah, because of COVID. Oh, okay. okay. So I'm just okay. placing the salmon like all over us. And we actually did too, a little too much. I could totally eat salmon any day. So like I'll oh. have this. Yeah. And you could you could substitute the salmon for whatever like chicken, chicken breast. I'd, yeah. I'd probably put like chicken breast or something like that. Totally. Mm. And, and then tuna, the flowers. And then the flowers we're just gonna decorate everywhere. I've got two kinds. I'm not. Sh- I think we should use those. Yeah, these are already broken yeah. and stuff. Okay. Well, I have another question. Mukao, how yes. did you feel when Woody's contacted you? I don't quite remember because it was so long ago. Like it was just like. A long time in the making. It's been a journey. Yeah, but I was. I Where did they get your excited. number? Did they email you? <laughs> <laughs> I'd worked with them before. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so I don't know where they're going. Just sprinkle. Like, yeah, just place them on, so that you can actually see Gosh, oh, the beauty beautiful. of the flower. Okay. This is just a masterpiece right here. Is all I'm gonna say. So you don't remember. I, I, I remember that I was quite excited and then it was like a waiting game and like... Oh. Did you ever get to a point where you're just like, oh God, if it doesn't happen, it's fine. If it happens, it's... You know what? That's actually my um, philosophy that like, if it's not the right thing, then it's not the right thing. Like with this um, Woolworths thing, yeah. it was supposed to happen sometime in April. Yeah. It only happened now, sure. and because it happened now, then the TV show could happen. Yeah, everything like, just fell, so into, much place. fell yeah. into place. Yeah, where if I could have like rushed it, yeah, there's so much that wouldn't would have necessarily out. have happened. Yeah. And I think so. it gave you time. This year, you, you like like your brand. You built a whole lot of your brand yeah. like during lockdown, getting everybody cooking. That's yeah. how we. And I got to have my own time exactly. as well before you know. Yeah. 
I want to put this white flower. Yeah, what I'm, is this here? I want like other colors as well. I see it's just purple and there is, there's this pretty one here. Fancy. Tell me who wouldn't want to have this. No, this is table. beyond delicious. Guys, to be honest, I'm one of the people who wouldn't have this salad. Because of the... Yeah, because of the it's flowers. It's pretty. It's really, really pretty. But yes. not because of the salmon. Oh, yeah. but, but you I can just switch that for Yeah, chicken. if I had it, if there was chicken here, definitely. Yeah, definitely. Or, so, or some beef even. Yeah, beef. But I think I prefer chicken. Beef can be a little tough to, mm. to chew. Yes. Oh, the premier's vlogmas. Yay. And we're so blessed. We've got Lazy with Corti with us. Yay. And look at our first course. Stunning. How beautiful does beautiful. the salad look? Stuffing. Really? Yeah. What? Mm. Do you put stuffing in your... No, but oh, in like a, turkey, like the turkey or chicken. Oh, the Are you guys doing turkey this year? Christmas. I find that it's very overrated. And Same it's always yeah. dry. Agreed. Agreed. I don't think it's nice. I think it looks pretty oh. on the table. Yeah. So this year we just opted for two full chickens instead I'm of a turkey. I just love a chicken. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, so I like to, take, oh. to peel this off. Ooh, it's Is it hot? hot? That's healthy. We can take it in turns. Let me use a, um, let me use this. I've got something we can use. Here we go. Oh, we I was going to say done. I can do this. Here we go. Oh, so this, oh, what are you, are we, are we going to throw that? Oh, it's chuck. Are you throwing it away? Yeah. yeah. You can't eat it. It's like leather. So what we're gonna do now is like score it. Oh. Ah. I'm in such a hurry to put it. I'm not like just waiting. Where's that other knife? So you need one that's kind of like really sharp. Okay. So not a blunt okay. knife. Um, and then you're just gonna do that. Okay. And then you're gonna place. So make like diamond like. Oh, kind of diamond like a whole pattern. Bob, Bob, friend. Thank you. I won't lie. I don't like the taste of a clove. Bites off. Yeah, I don't do that. It's got such a strong taste. So just remember that you're not like yes, digging into it. It's very lively. Like just on the top. Oh, so that it can just shine through when it's um, grown. So you can see those lines when it's done, but okay. it's, you're not like slicing. Okay. Actually, when we were shooting the show, Kaya like sliced Slice everything. Very hard. I was just like, now we know how you get it. it. <laughs> so okay. if you just take them out, just put them here. And then you so, stick them in like what's this? Yeah. Oh, That's what I was saying. Yeah. Friend tastes so bitter if you bite it by itself. Yeah, it does. I saved my champagne. Oh, yay! champagne. This is actually the perfect one to make with this cocktail. Yay. Um, and I'll tell you why. Wow. So this is called an ice prosecco. Okay. So not just like a normal prosecco. It's called an ice prosecco. I you don't can even know what a normal prosecco is, but it's continue. like um. So MMC is South African, Champagne okay. is French, okay. and then uh, Prosecco is Italian. 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 Yes. Can you trust me with this cork? I you thought you were going to flambe. What's flambe? Like, <laughs> with a knife. Light. Can you do it? Oh my, no. I'm sure you can. Friend. We'll just break your window. Oh my gosh. Okay, so, so now, now <laughs> my favorite part, now we're putting the glaze the over. So you can go Brilliant. all around, all over, like just oh, get it on there. Um, oh, it's fine that some goes on to, it's all just going to bake nicely oh. there. We'll take photos for you anyway. Nami, nami, nami. Yes, yes. And then we can even wow, like that looks finish off with some more honey. honey. So honey, maple syrup, it just goes beautiful. I've never had a lot with the mint. No, it's beautiful. With mints. Okay, perfect. There we go. So now this is gonna go into our preheated oven. Always preheat your oven. Mm -hmm. uh, we're gonna do about ten minutes. So until it's like nice sticky, and sticky, yeah. and yeah. do we close? No, no, no. Okay. Okay. I will put this in in our Le Creuset pot. There's a lot here. Guys, we didn't talk about our aprons. Oh my god! How sexy do we look? The cutest aprons ever. I know. Okay. Are we toasting? We can do the toasting um, on our website. Okay, amazing. This is a toast to a good year, new friends, yeah. um, new aprons, <laughs> um, 
success and blessings in mm-hmm. the middle of a pandemic. Right. Right. right? So many blessings. Thank Cheers. you. Okay, what are we making now? Cookies. cookies. So now we're doing the cookies. What's in our kit? You get everything. Yes. Let's so you just get this cute kit. Um, I think two. Like maybe a biggish one and a smallish one. Um, and there's actually another one. Where's that other one, Candice? The baking here? Yeah, right here. So you can choose whichever one. I actually have this at home. You sent these to us. Yeah, I haven't made mine yet. You can can make them. Yeah. Which one did I get? No, these aren't the ones I got. I think I got these ones, but not chocolate. Oh yeah, the vanilla ones. The vanilla ones. Yeah. Okay, so Candice is gonna do the butter and the sugar. Okay. And then to that she's gonna add the chocolate mix, mm-hmm. and then mix that, I and then make pour the in the milk, and combining to form a dough. Okay. Then we're gonna roll it. Out I don't trust it. The last the time she made you know the, what? The, 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 the okay, the, 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 the It was my first time on camera, <laughs> and it was really stressful. And then I was making bread. Do you know how hard it is to make bread? So you were, were you nervous because of the camera or it was what? Like, that? What? Why? Wow, you didn't even seem nervous. You were you were like confident. It was scary. So I'm gonna wash these okay. and you, you'll just cut that out because we need them. How much butter? So do those are now we can ask them. But can we just ask Brendan about that idombolo? It was very good. It was incredible. He didn't finish it. And Candice, you sent it home with, you sent all of it home I didn't, you guys ate it all. No, my house. That was my trick, was that I wasn't gonna eat it. Exactly! Because I, I was trying to be healthy. No, cause you knew what you put in it. So you cut it so we can use it to do that. With the so you're just cutting all around. around. Oh. Yeah. Candice, do you remember how to say Iran Tambo? I'm literally was about to tell you. Yeah. All the time. I say all the time. Would you, would you like to hear me say this? I'd like you to. Would you like it. to hear it? Yes. Hear me say this? Yes. Ilwa Ntombo. Yeah. Ilwa Ntombo. It's actually my favorite thing to say. Did you ignore the chef's instructions? Friend, all you blatantly <laughs> went against her instructions. You know what I've realized is I need to get a beer. <laughs> At least the handheld. You know, I have one. I bought one, I think, when we were baking. When we were baking. Yeah, yes. I literally went and bought How good is this though? Oh, it's my oh, top. Oh. <laughs> Do you hate dogs? No, terrible. I just didn't see him coming in. They're like, who, who's and this he's man licking his ass? And friend, he's basically a hippo. He's not huge. He is. He's, he's, he's like a hippo. Okay, so you're mixing that until it's all like combined. Here we go. And then you're adding the chocolate mix. Okay. And that's this. Let me just do a little video. Candace, this filter tags you, but it makes us look gold. I think you look incredible. What's wrong with gold? <laughs> I'm getting off meat. I'm doing the Daniel fast. Friend, what is in that Daniel, now? Daniel fast um, in the Bible when... Oh, yes. I know Daniel from the Bible. Yeah, Daniel, so... Just clump it together oh, until it's like, So yeah. Daniel and his friends, <laughs> Daniel and the Hebrew boys decided to not eat meat, but they decided to just eat... Um, like food that grows from the ground, like fruit, f- fruits and vegetables, because the meat but was only sacri- if it falls off the tree. Yeah, because mm-hmm. the meat was then sacrificed to idols and blah blah blah, and so they said to the king, no, they don't want to have it. So then that became a thing, a Daniel fast for 21 days, and the reason mm-hmm. for 21 days is because he had been, pray- been praying, and the angel came back with the answer on the 21st day, and then he said to him, no, the Lord answered your prayer a long time ago. It's just that I had, I was fighting the prince. Of Would you like me to do it with you? Please. Okay. Let's do it. Let me know the. Okay, we start in January. So, um, churches normally start on the same day, but we decided to start a little earlier mm-hmm. um, because I normally fast on my birthday, and this year I didn't want to fast on my birthday. So, we're going to start on the second so that by the 23rd, um, we're oh, done. Oh, you're done. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Are you doing it with us, Candice? I'm doing it with you. Okay. Which means no cake, no champagne, nothing. Just water. I thought you said meat. No. <laughs> Are you out now? <laughs> <laughs> that looks like poop. <laughs> and you weren't even going to say that. Brendan, so are gonna you getting the knife? This is oh. To like cut. I was so confused about how we were going to manage Me that. too. So. so Candace, are you now out of the Daniel fast since you... you it's I not just think that I just need to review <laughs> what is taken off the list. Can we have the knife? <laughs> can I have coffee though? You can, but with no milk, no sugar. Oh God. <laughs> <laughs> Can this please grease that for us? I'll get spray and cook or butter? Spray and cook, please. Okay. Oh, cool. I'm not doing that. One healthy thing about this recipe 
is that we won't have butter on the board. That's the only healthy thing. The rest, we're not going to do that time. outside to avoid talking. Yeah, the fume. <laughs> Do you guys know that I basically dress some Premier and Brendan, so when they look fabulous, <laughs> it's clean. <'cause> you. <laughs> <laughs> you actually do. And then when there's only one item of something amazing in a shop, I always donate it to Premier. <laughs> you donated one hat! It was one hat! And everywhere we go! If you are uncertain about which hat that is, it's the one that she wears in every <laughs> picture. <laughs> Not our homes, but his parents' homes. And when I come back, homes. a home. 
a home in Switzerland and there's a, we have a home in South of France. When we get when we arrive, when we get on the plane mm -hmm. and the air hostess greets us with a South African accent You're and so we're on our way home, I'm like, I'm going I'm home. home. And I love home. And I love I, you know what I think we we forget sometimes? We have such a rich culture of people. Yep. And I love that about us. And I love how friendly and open we are. Yeah. And I don't feel 100%. like when I stand in a grocery store overseas that I can go to someone and be like, oh my goodness. Mm. I haven't tried that yet. Like, tell yeah. me about it. Yeah. yeah. And in South Africa, people are just so open very and kind nice. and very, I feel like we are a very strong nation. We are. Yeah. I don't know. So you wouldn't, wanna, you wouldn't want to move. No, here. I think we holidays are enough. And the weather. Where do you want to move? No, where would um, you want to live? I'm probably gonna. Uh -uh. It's already happening. <laughs> After her three years with Woolies, we can, we've got time. Friends, can you even? Can you? Come on, that's not even. Okay, I'm gonna use this. Cut into the. Come on. Can you how long have you had these? I don't know. But this line is gonna be perfection. For the cocktail. Okay, it's just for the cocktail. Dip that into. Um, oh, is that how you get that sugary yeah. stuff? Oh, and then, oh my gosh, guys, I'm doing this for my family. They're going to be so impressed. <gasps> wow, so, yeah. this is amazing. What did you put in here? So in here is just a lemon juice. So you would use... Or I would have cut it and then just rubbed it on, on ah. the rim. Oh my gosh. Guys, this is how the restaurants do it. Hmm. And then okay, afterwards... Nice. That's beautiful. There you go. And then you can just garnish to your heart's content. So Jay, we are dead. This is beautiful. Yeah, I'm gonna add some berries. Like you can use whichever berries you like. You can add in some mint. Why are berries mushy? Hey? Why are the berries mushy? When you take them out of the fridge, sometimes they get mushy. Yeah. <laughs> so now the dream goes our prosecco. I just don't know how much. I think I may have gone overboard. You think? <laughs> So Candice, if I go to Switzerland, can I borrow your house? Totally. <laughs> there is always said yes. <laughs> Just letting him know. Guys, this is and pretty. Now, we can grab I won't lie, this looks very pretty. Nice. Yes. Are we done? We're always losing the knife. We're always losing the knife. And then you can just garnish the Can we our cookies and then set our table? Yes. And then... We are done. We had so much fun in the kitchen. Candace set the table. We all set the table. I set the table. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Candace set the table and then we put the food on the yeah, table. And you asked the cookies. cookies. Yeah. 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 But yeah. we all made the food, right? Mm -hmm. Who did most of the work? You know who wow, did most of the work. No. She did. She you did. know who did I'll most of the work. Okay, did. you did, did the most work, but this was fun. Um, we are going to leave the, you're going to send me the recipe, we're going to yes. leave it in the description box, mm -hmm. and guys, as we tell you, you don't forget to get your book. <laughs> you need this book in your life. And you can't have the book without the apron. It, no. just, does, it just doesn't work. And if you are using her recipes, please do tag, take pictures, let's have yes. fun, happy vlogmas, happy holidays, we love you, we're going to go have some fun, yes. and go eat our yes. lives away. Bye! Bye.